it's Lou from O Liverpool Lou back again with another little video for you. How are you all? I hope that you're all having lovely days out there, whatever it is that you're up to. Um, I am just coming on here for a quick little video. This isn't going to be a long one. Um, it's just to share with you the details of a little giveaway that I thought that I would do to celebrate reaching 500 followers on Instagram which I know isn't very much to many people, but it seems like quite a lot to me, especially because the majority of you are um, sewing people, my people. Um, so I'm just really glad that people have found me and that you have liked my photos and followed me for all my dressmaking content. It's, it pleases me greatly. It's so nice. Um, yeah, so I said I'd, I'd probably do a little giveaway about that. Um, and here I am, I'm doing it. Um, so I'll give you the details in a minute, but first of all, I just wanted to give you a few little bits of news um, that have happened since the last time that I was on. The loveliest thing of all is that the amazing and gorgeous Lisa Kitch of the channel and so on um, did a really great thing. She organized a giveaway for reaching 3000 subscribers on her YouTube channel. Um, and part of the criteria for entering the give giveaway was to check out some uh, so other sewing vloggers that she recommended. And one of them was me. I was extremely touched and flattered that she picked me out of all the brilliant vloggers out there um, amongst these, these other fab girls as well. I think there were seven that she shared, which was just lovely. Um, so I ended up getting a flurry of new subscribers on in, um, on YouTube, um, which just was the loveliest thing ever. It was such a nice surprise. And so my videos have been watched and liked and uh, you've all been leaving really lovely comments and feedback. And it's just been so nice. So Lisa, mwah, massive thank you to you. Um, yeah, I think she got my subscribers up from about 50, <laughs> which meant the world to me, um, to I think I'm at about 175 now um, in like a week. So, well, less than a week actually. Um, so yeah, she tripled my subscribers, which was just fab. And I'm really pleased to have you all here and I hope you enjoy all my videos. Yeah, so thanks to Lisa. Uh, what else has been going on? Oh, little news. It's not, part, it's not little news. Obviously, like everyone else in the sewing community, I have my copy of Stretch by Tilly. Tilly, I love you. That is true. I do. I love her. Um, yeah, this, this book. Oh my gosh, where to start? I'm so excited by it. There are loads of... Um, review videos out there so check some of them out um, I won't do one now because there's just oodles of them but yeah I'm very excited I think I'll show you what I'm probably going to make first I think just to give you a little tip about that I think I'm going to do the Freya uh, which has proved very popular on Instagram so this is the Freya top um, you've probably seen the dress which is amazing with the ruffle on it It's just perfection, isn't it? It's perfection. I think what I'm gonna do is make a top version of this with a ruffle in some uh, red and white stripey or blue and white stripey jersey that I have. Hold on, I'm gonna show it to you. It's in my stash, just one sec. Okay, so this is the, the red version that I've got. It's a lovely, pingy, stretchy, bouncy jersey. I think it might even have, no, it hasn't got two-way stretch really. It's lovely. Um, so I think that would work really well. And I also have it in a lovely dark navy. Um, it's the same stuff. Um, so I think both, they're going to work really nicely for a Freya with, with the mock neck and the ruffle. So watch this space. I might make it to go with my flint clots, which I'm still working on. Uh, yeah, so that's other news. I got my gorgeous stretch book in the post and it arrived more quickly than I expected, actually. So I was like buzzing about that. It was amazing. Um, right, what else did I need to share with you? Yeah, I haven't really got much sewing. Well, I haven't got any sewing to show you in this video. Um, the project that I've been working on lately is uh, the Megan Nielsen Flint Collots. Um, I've nearly finished them. They're sitting on my cutting table over there. I've just got to add the waistband um, and hem them. Um, but they're looking pretty good so far. Um, hopefully I'll have them finished over this weekend. 
and then I can make a little video and share them with you. But wouldn't the Freya top go nicely with those? I'll have, maybe have to make an entire outfit and and um, take some photos of them together. Um, yeah, I've been doing a bit of adulting this week. I went into my husband's school and um, covered on the front reception desk for a week, which was lovely fun. Um, I did used to work there actually for, for a year or so, um, a little while back, and it was really, really nice to see everyone and do a lot of, oh, hi, 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 all of that. It was really nice. So that's why I haven't really been doing much sewing. Um, I was kind of wiped out by the end of every day and I just had to sleep. <laughs> so I didn't sew. But it is spring break now, spring break. Yeah, my husband teaches at an American international school so they have spring break, not like us Brits who have Easter holidays. Um, so he's on spring break for two weeks. So we'll be sort of pottering around together um, and hopefully I'll get a fair bit of sewing done and you'll see my flint clots soon enough. Yeah, so on to the reason why I'm really doing this video, the giveaway. Here is the prize. This is my personal copy of The Beginner's Guide to Dressmaking by Wendy Ward, who is known on social media as That Wendy Ward. She's a brilliant um, dressmaking and sewing teacher. I think she's based in Brighton in the UK. Um, and she's got a few really fab books. Now, as, as I say, this, this is my personal copy. However, it's not, it's not battered. It's not really that well thumbed. I've used it for, um, you know, using techniques and, and instructions for things and ideas for things. And it's been really useful for that. However, I haven't actually made any of the patterns in this book. So all of the patterns are in there, uncut. I have taken them out, look, they're all here. Um, They've not even been traced, so they're all in one piece for you. And there are, I believe, six patterns in there. Um, let me show you. Just hold the line, please. Um, come on, Lulu. Oh, here you go. So six patterns with hacks and variations, which is brilliant. There's a t-shirt, there's a skirt, there's little um, trousers. Oh, a skirt with a fishtail detail. The jacket, part of me is actually loath to give this away because I really like that jacket with the side um, zip closure. I think it's really cool. Um, and then there's a lovely little dress as well, a little shift dress. You can put collars on it. You can do it um, sleeveless. Loads of lovely options for, you know, fab basics for your wardrobe, really. I just feel like... Um, since I haven't made any, any of the patterns, it seems like it's a bit of a waste it's sitting there and it could be, um, you know, going on to somebody who needs it a bit more than me. So that's why I've chosen this as the prize. Um, rules and regs for entering. There aren't many, really. I would say um, all you need to do is make sure that you are subscribed to my channel, to my YouTube channel. Uh, make sure that you're following me on Instagram. Um, my handle is O Liverpool Lou. I'll, I'll put it in the description below. Um, well, it's O underscore Liverpool underscore Lou. To be precise. Um, so yeah, make sure you're sub subscribed on here. Follow me on there. And then... Um, what you could do as well, I think, which would make it easier for me to find people who are entering. Well, what you should do is um, find a photograph on my Instagram feed that you like and put a comment on there. Um, and the comment can be hashtag lose 500 giveaway. So I'll put that in the notes below, um, in the descript description below as well. Um, yeah, I hope that's clear. So it's three things you've got to do. You need to subscribe on here, you need to follow me on Instagram, and you need to put a comment on one of my Instagram photos with the hashtag lose500 giveaway. You can say other things as well as you like, if you like, as long as they're nice, don't say anything mean, please. <laughs> um, but I know none of you are like that, you're all lovely, so I have no fear where that's concerned. Happy to ship it anywhere in the world, um, and I will leave the, um, oh, I should have put a date for how long I wanted to put this on for. I was thinking a week, but maybe I'll make it two weeks. I don't know how many people are going to be interested in this anyway. So it's the 23rd now. Um, let's say a week. I'll, I'll leave it up for a week. So next Friday, which is, uh, is that going to be the 30th? 
sorry, I'm not very good at adding up, am I? Anyway, yeah, a week, next Friday, and I'll, I'll finish it. So, um, yeah, I hope you enjoy the giveaway, and I hope you enjoy the competition, and I hope that all made sense to you. I feel like I didn't explain it very well. Um, but, yeah, if you have any questions, just ask me. Please go ahead and ask. Um, finally, um, I just want to say, my hair did this by itself today. Does that ever happen to you? It doesn't happen to me. It's put itself into this amazing, like, squiggly, swirly do. And I did nothing to make it happen. I mean, I often wake up with it in a very strange looking hairdo that's just decided to do itself. It's never nice. Um, so I feel like this is a really great day. It was a day to record a vlog, a day to show this beautiful wacky hair that just did it by itself, and a day to say thank you to you all for subscribing and following and being so gorgeous. Um, yeah, keep watching. Um, I will do another video soon with my flint collots, hopefully. Um, yeah, I love you all. Keep stitching.